Hello, all you space engineers out there. Commander Kingfish here, and it is Mod Wednesday. Well, today's mod is actually a little bit different than what I normally do. Uh, I am actually doing a blueprint today, which I found this uh, mod, particular mod, and it's pretty cool looking. It's called the Sephiric, and it's by Necron910. Uh, it is, and this is the way he describes it. It's a simple but powerful energy generator. Uses cold nuclear syntaxes and Tesla coils and whatnot. And, uh, at night, it looks really cool, and I'll show you uh, what it looks like at night. But in the end, it's just basically a nuclear reactor, and it's basically a base. Uh, so if we go inside over here. And this thing is huge. You can see how big this is. Uh, I'm in creative, so I didn't have to go through and build it all. But I dropped it down and, and did not realize exactly how large it was. But if we go inside, there's four different entrances to this thing. And let's get in here. And so basically you got this large nuclear reactor. He's got some conveyor ports set up. He has a, uh, uh, a single cargo container, which uh, you can fill up with uh, uh, uranium and fill up the reactor with uranium. And you'd probably never have to worry about power again if you had access to that much stuff, uh, that much uranium. So, uh, but if you walk around in here, he's got lockers, he's got desks. Uh, shelving with parts on it. Uh, really did a really nice job on this. Uh, you've got containers and text panels with graphics on it. So it really looks pretty cool actually. Uh, so that's the inside and if you fly around in here a little bit you can kind of see you've got this uh, uh, particular uh, area just as this one single compartment now if we go outside let's get over here we'll go outside and we can fly around out here uh, you can kind of see he just used a lot of different parts to really make this look pretty cool so uh, here's a, uh, a wheel component that's not done uh, he's got uh, uh, half armor blocks and half slope armor blocks in here with different textures on it. He's got rotors uh, with uh, lighting effects on it here. He's got two different sets of those and if we go up a little higher you can see what he's got up here. Same thing, rotors. Uh, he's got these light pillars here uh, we get up above and he's used well he's used stairs uh, as part of the decoration he's got uh, power efficiency modules here and he's got uh, off-road wheel suspensions that he's used just to give it really kind of a uh, nice design to the whole thing so it really looks cool and again it is huge so, uh, and again, it's a blueprint. So if you're looking for it, uh, you, you won't find it in your normal blocks, uh, but it will be part of your blueprints if you subscribe to this. Let's take a look at this and see what it looks like at night real quick. And then that'll about wrap this up. Yeah, do this. Let's get the night uh, vision going here. Uh, there we go and let me get out of here it really the graphics and everything on it it really looks pretty cool so if you fly away from it you can kind of see it really stands out there's no question about it that uh, that is huge and it's uh, part of the uh, uh, a really big part of component to the base. Uh, 
I think this will add some interest in your builds. If nothing else, it's fun to take a look at it in creative and just see what uh, how uh, Necron did, did all of this and maybe give you some ideas with your own base building. All right, uh, let me get landed down here and turn my lights on, get off of here. Uh, let me uh, actually get out of here, get back to daylight. There we go. All right. The magic of creative. All right. So that is Sephirix. It is by Necron 910. And I've got the link to his workshop down below. Check it out. I think you'll be, uh, you'll like it. Uh, I find it very interesting. All right. Well, if you like the video, please hit that thumbs up. It really helps out the video a lot. Uh, and uh, please subscribe. That really helps the channel out a lot. And with that, Commander Kingfish is out of here. And I will see you all in the next video. Thanks for watching, everyone.